This morning my eight-year-old comes downstairs, she says, hey, I lost a tooth, and I say, when? I panicked, okay? I don't know how she lost it. Parents, put your kids in the pantry, let's get real, okay? I don't know if she still believes in the tooth fairy. I have no idea, okay? I know her stance on Santa, and it's not good. And I quote, Santa is trash, okay? <laughs> how do you feel about the tooth fairy? <laughs> I'm gonna puke. Don't touch me! She told me she didn't put her tooth under a pillow. Phew, I'm off the hook for a night. But she did tell me she clutched it in her fist the entire night because she wanted to catch the tooth fairy, which one, leads me to believe she's way smarter than I thought, or B, she, she's way smarter than I thought. I'm playing right into her trap. This is your fault somehow. I'm gonna be honest, I underestimate her a lot, okay? But I sharpen that stick, I should know how it pokes. I have an obligation as a father to reward my child with cash while she sleeps anytime a tooth falls out, which seems like something you don't wanna incentivize an eight-year-old who loves money for. If I don't play this right, she's gonna swan dive face first into concrete, okay? Do I think she's gonna catch me? Yeah, like eight out of 10, <laughs> I, I'm not confident. For one, she has somehow just all of a sudden developed the ability to be a light sleeper. You know what, since y'all are here, do you have change for a credit card? I don't carry cash. Over the last couple teeth that she had lost, I've had to hear about the sporadic and declining payment methods of the tooth fairy. And then I have to explain to her that, you know, in inflation, the gas prices and the overseas tax reform and Democratic Party. I'm not an economist, okay? I don't know how to explain it to her how, that I don't have more money. But you can dang near convince an eight-year-old about anything as long as you don't stutter, okay? Which is a big problem for me. Now I know what you're thinking. What are you gonna do if you get caught? Panic? <laughs> One of the biggest obstacles that I'm facing is that she sleeps on a bunk bed on the top and I'm more of a single bed stature. Maybe even blow up mattress in the guest room or blankets on the floor because your parents came to town without asking. Um, <laughs> I said we just take out the rest of her teeth now. That way it saves me the hassle, heartache, and cash and try to convince her that the tooth fairy is real for one last year. I can do this. I don't know how. You can put your tooth under your pillow. I want to see if the tooth fairy is real. You're going to say, what do you think the tooth fairy is? You. You think I'm the tooth fairy? Yeah. Okay. Get to bed. It's crazy, crazy talk. Which pillow are you putting it under? This one? This. <gasps> Hi. <laughs> <laughs> That was already here. Do you have my tooth? Huh? Do you have my tooth? Uh, no, this, what? Oh, look, what the heck? Okay, have a good night. Love you. Yeah, I got caught.